In this video, we'll be showcasing the new integration between TaxCaddy and SafeSend Returns. If your firm hasn't done so already, you will have to perform a one-time setup to enable a handshake between TaxCaddy and SafeSend Returns. To do this, log into the SurePrep file room. In the top right-hand corner, navigate to TaxCaddy. Click on the Administrative tab, then the External Connections sub-tab, then API. Here you can generate a new API key. Click Copy to copy the key. Next, log in to SafeSend Returns. On the left-hand panel in SafeSend Returns, select Settings, then General. Click on the button below TaxCaddy Integration. Here you can add a new API key. Paste in your copied key, click Add, then OK. You can add API keys for any applicable domain. Make sure the toggle is set to Enable, then Save and Close. This concludes the first time setup. When the first time setup is complete, you're now ready to start sending tax returns with Safe Send Returns. Let's send a tax return to our client, Dan Lyon. In Safe Send Returns, click the blue Upload button in the top right. Using the drag and drop area, upload the taxpayer's tax return. Once the return is uploaded, you'll see it's pulled the tax client ID. Select the ERO slash signer and click Submit. The tax return will take a few moments to process. Select All Assignments on the left-hand tab. Once the assignment for the taxpayer is in the Ready status, you'll be able to proceed. Select Actions and Process Return. Confirm the taxpayer's information on the right-hand panel. Then click Finished. Safe Send Returns will check with TaxCaddy to see if there are any matching taxpayers. Here we can see the match, compare the details, and confirm the match. With the match confirmed, we can now deliver and send the final documents to TaxCaddy. At this point, the assignment is preparing for delivery, and the taxpayer will take over for the rest of the process. With the tax return delivered to the taxpayer, we can now take a look at what their experience is like. The taxpayer will receive an email from SafeSend Returns, requesting them to review their tax return and sign their e-file authorization. Clicking the link provided allows them to sign in. They will authenticate their login by providing the last four digits of their SSN and then receive a verification code. Once signed in, they'll click Let's Get Started. Safe Send Returns lets the taxpayer know that TaxCaddy will be able to download all of their documents at the end of the process, but they can also download the documents locally to their machine as well. The taxpayer will click Continue to begin the e-signature process. In the first step, they'll verify their date of birth and click Continue. Next, they'll sign the 8879 by clicking the location indicated and providing their signature. Clicking Next will take them to each signature location. Once they've finished, they'll click Continue. Next, they'll arrive at the Tax Payment Vouchers screen, where they'll see options to pay their tax payment vouchers. These vouchers will also be downloaded to TaxCaddy at the end of the process. The taxpayer can click Done and take a look at them in TaxCaddy. Safe Send Returns lets the taxpayer know that they've completed all the required steps. In the taxpayer's TaxCaddy account, they'll find their documents delivered from Safe Send Returns. Under the Documents tab for Tax Year 2017, under the Uploaded Documents, 
they'll find a new tax preparation invoice fee and a signed e-file authorization. Under the Tax Returns tab, they will have received the filing instructions as well as the 2017 tax returns. In the 2018 tax year under Tax Payments, TaxCaddy has downloaded all their tax payment vouchers to be tracked. This concludes the showcase of the new integration between TaxCaddy and SafeSend Returns. We look forward to simplifying your tax time.